its logwood uh, chips. And you can make almost kind of a tea with these wood shavings. Are you filming? Let's put a little bit in there like that. So this is uh, boiling water and the initial dye Ooh. released. This is pretty color here. Yeah. And you know, Christy and I were talking and, and it seems like you know, color changes are certainly the, the, one of the things that, that first attracted me to chemistry. But this is the, uh, this is the logwood steeping. So I've got a variety of different solutions here. Let's see what color changes we can make with this uh, natural logwood dye here from this wood. And just keep in mind that natural um, by no means means safe and by no means does it mean uh, non-toxic necessarily. So anyway, here we go. We'll uh, dilute some down so you can see the lovely uh, kind of a orangey red color. This is a uh, little bit of lemon, a uh, little bit of vinegar, so acid. And we get a yellow. And let's see, washing soda or baking soda. Lovely, a purple color. Yeah, look at that rich, uh, like a raspberry. Uh, this one is alum. Oh, lovely, wonderful purples there. And this is iron sulfate, so from iron tablets. You get a bluish black with that material. Actually, it's more like a brownish black. So, lots of different color changes. That's why I love. That's really what got me started in, in chemistry to begin with.